trying to get it together. I'm trying to practice moderation, which is the least interesting option for an aging partier. <laughs> you know, nobody likes that guy. Nobody likes the guy who gets their shit together. <laughs> what you gonna do tonight, Kyle? I'm like two beers, drive home, watch Forensic Files. Fuck that guy. <laughs> nobody like, that guy's no fun. A sensible jackass. Because you got three options. You got like moderation, or you get totally sober, you know, maybe even go into program, and that's, that's interesting and mysterious. And somebody's like, oh, I can't, I just don't drink. Like, you never drank? No, I, I'm in AA. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh, what happened? Did you kill somebody? Probably can't tell me. Oh, you can tell me. Oh my God, it's such a mystery, and mystery's sexy. Look at that sexy, mysterious man. Not drinking in the corner. I want to know him. <laughs> or you could just keep partying way past an acceptable age and scare your loved ones. Yeah, yeah you know, embrace it. You could be, you're the space shuttle and your peer group are just the booster rockets. <laughs> Accompanying you on a way to a mission you won't return from. <laughs> you get to the right age and altitude where they all start peeling off. Like, I gotta get up for work tomorrow. I got kids. And you're the space shuttle just cruising towards the moon going, let's find some coke. <laughs> Everybody's got that friend. <laughs> Man, can you believe Billy died? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> that guy's a real maniac. Yeah. So I had Bill's funeral written on a post-it note, and I was just moving that around my calendar for like the last two months, because I knew that that was going to be a floating engagement that I was going to ask for time off of work for. <laughs> <laughs>